hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding how to add archive and unarchive option in odoo so if you go to the products form view so i'll go to the sales and then to the products and if i open the first product and if you click on action button you have an option called archive so you can see you have an option called archive so this option can be used to set the record as an inactive one so there might be some case in the system where we have to kept the uh, a record in an inactive mode like it should not be accessible anywhere in the system and we cannot delete but we should keep it as archived like what i can say it should not be used but it should be there in the system so in such cases we can use or utilize the options of archive and unarchive so right now you can see if i come here and if i search for a product cabinet we can see the system is returning two records but in some cases due to some issues and we found that the product is damaged and we cannot sell it to customer until we fix so we have to kept it as archived because else the salesperson will come and he may sell this product to customer so in such cases what we can do we can utilize archive option so right now once i archive this record you can see right now i have archived this record and if i duplicate this tab and right now if i search for cabinet over the search you can see the system will not return this product you can see it only showing one product similarly if i go to the quotation and then to the sale order so this is the sale order form i'll just choose customer and if i search for cabinet over here also it doesn't return this product it will be in an inactive state so we will be discussing about how we will be adding such an option inside our hospital module so if i go to the hospital module we have patients and inside the action we have only delete and duplicate option so we will be seeing about how we can add archive and unarchive option here so first of all i'll go to the pie charm and here we have the patient model hospital dot patient so if i come back again to the ui you can see the model is hospital dot patient and we need the option for this model so what you have to do you have to simply add a new field named active so this is the reserved keyword in odoo for archive and unarchive just you need to add a boolean field with name active simply i'll add like this active equal to fields dot boolean so simply add a field so either you can give string or not it's up to you string i'll give active or you can give any string that doesn't matter simply add with technical name active and of type boolean so i have just added now i'll copy this name and i will add the same inside the form view so under the age or under the gender i will add it so what i have done is i have added the field inside the model of type boolean with name active and same field i have added in the form view now i will restart the service as i have made change inside the python code and i'll come to the ui and i will upgrade im hospital module so i'll just click on upgrade so initially we and we checked we don't have the archive option for the patients now the module has been upgraded successfully and you can see where is our records we already have created three records and everything disappeared now because it will be over here active false because we haven't set the default value as true we, ha we have to set the default value as true else the existing record will take the value as active false so simply i have passed default as true so once you add active false active field make sure that you provide default as true so this default value will be supplied to existing records so i'll upgrade the module once again 
so i'll come here and i will upgrade the module so the module has been upgraded so all our records are in archived state now so i'll come here add filter active is false apply so i have filtered and now if you click on here you can see an archive option or you can directly tick here active true active true so right now all the records will be listed here active true so if you open this you will see you have archive option so once you archive what happens is once you archive the value of the active field will be set to false so you can see right now the value of this boolean field is true once i click on archive you can see it gets false and if i unarchive you can see it get true so what Odoo does is once we archive the active field the value of the active field will be set to false and once we unarchive Odoo will set its value to true again so normally once we add this field in the view we will be keeping it as an invisible field so we will add an attribute invisible so this attribute will make the field invisible inside the view so i'll just go to the ui apps menu and i'll upgrade the om hospital module so i'll come back to the hospital patients now the field has been uh, disappeared because we have set invisible one now if i come back here you can see you have the archive option and unarchive if you archive the record it will show the unarchive right now we have three and if you click on you will have the options over here also so i will select two records odoo and erp click on archive it disappeared so right now we have only one record others are archived so you have to come to filters and you have to filter archive false then only you can see those record so once you add this archive and unarchive for a model make sure that you have add to you have to add a filter here so you have to add a filter here like i'll copy this and i'll add filter as filter archived to filter like right now once we archive the records and if i need to see that right now we have to manually go and select so instead that we will be showing an archived filter here so i'm just adding filter archived and i'll give the string as archived and what domain active equal to so i already told once we click on archive what odoo does is odoo will set the value of active field as false so we will be filtering based on active field equal to false so i have added a filter here now i'll go to the ui and i'll just upgrade hospital management module so the module is getting upgraded and you can see in the filter we have archived so on clicking it will show archived records so this is how you can add archive and unarchive option in odo just add a active field of type boolean with default as true and add it to your form view so it has to be added so you may thought why we need to add it here so if you didn't add inside the form the archive option will not appear so i'll show you simply i'll click on edit view form and if i remove this from here i'll simply delete save refresh you won't see archive option so in order to see that you must add the field as invisible in your form so if i upgrade the module again the archive option will come so the inside database system will rewrite this code you can see archive has been comes now because the code come back so this is how you can add archive and unarchive option in Odoo. so that's it for this day if you have any doubts feedbacks or suggestions don't hesitate to share it with us over the email or you can directly comment under the video and also 
If you like the video, please do click the like button, subscribe the channel, press the bell icon so that you won't miss any videos from Oromates. So that's it for the day. Have a nice day. Thank you.